What is up you guys? It is the Mice 45 here and in this video I'm gonna be showing you guys how to use theme juicer themes without a custom ROM. And uh before you do this, um you may be asking yourself what are theme choose what is theme chooser? So uh, basically um theme chooser is uh, a feature that comes with a custom ROM which um, in case you don't know what a custom ROM is it's ba it basically changes the way uh, the, all, the overall look and feel of your Android smartphone or tablet and um, basically changes the way it looks, the way it feels and sometimes it can help you upgrade to a later version of Android and uh, basically in every custom ROM they have a feature in it called a theme chooser which allows you to use different themes that let you um, change the way your um, Android device looks like. You can download a theme that um, for Sign in Jamad 11, something like I'm using right now as of this video, you could use themes to make your device look like KitKat or make it look like a Samsung device or an ACC device or whatever. And um, uh yeah so uh that's basically what theme chooser is now be in order for you to get that feature before you needed to install a custom rom which not everyone wants to do because they don't want to change everything about their android device but now thanks to this app this um app sort of brings that feature to any rooted device on the stock um, ROM of their Android device and now you can use any theme you want from the Google Play Store and uh, use this app to install that theme without having to change the whole ROM and right now I'm gonna show you how to do that on your Android device okay so before you do this you will need to make sure that your Android device is rooted if you don't know how to do that just go on Google and search how to root space the name of your Android device like for me for example I'm using my Samsung Galaxy Tab 2 7.0 space the model number of your Android device if you want to find out what model number your Android device is go into your settings and then scroll down to about tablet or about phone and whatever number you see under the word model number that's your model number like for me for example my model number is GTP 3110 then go ahead and search for it and find a guy that can help you and follow that guide very carefully because one rooting does void your warranty so keep that in mind and two rooting can break your Android device which means it can damage your Android device internally or software based so in case it does I am not responsible for any of the damage that will happen to your Android device then once you're finished and you're rooted and you have super su installed or super user installed you can go ahead and start with the procedure okay so first once you make sure you're rooted we're gonna go into the Google Play Store and wait for it to load up and once it's fully loaded up, tap the search icon at the top right, and then type in winter board. Okay, well, it just spelled out wine glass. <laughs> winter board. Then choose the one that's made by Sarric IT, comma, LLC, and make sure it's that one. Go ahead and install it. What? then tap accept then wait for the app to download and install then once it finishes installing and you get a pop-up like this scroll down and then download the other app which is called Cydia Substrate and then tap install at the top and then tap accept then wait for the app to download and install on your Android device then once that's finished go ahead and tap open then here at the top you'll see something there that says link substrate files tap it then you will be you will be asked to grant it root permission so make sure you do grant it by following whatever prompt it gives you by tapping allow or tapping grant then once 
you get to uh, this screen and it's done linking the substrate files tap where it says restart system soft and it will do a soft reboot of your Android device then once it does that you can go ahead and go into winterboard and from there uh, it'll ask you to it'll ask you for root permissions as well make sure you grant it root permissions and then from there uh, that's it really from there the app should be up and running and now you can download a theme for your Android device and to do that you will need to go back into the Google Play Store then make tap the search icon at the top then type in um, whatever ROM you're using space theme I'm using sign Jamaat 11 so I typed in CM11 theme and then you can go ahead and download any theme that supports your ROM you can download any theme for sign from sign into mod 11 or paranoid android you can download any theme for those custom roms choose whatever you like then if you found one that you like like this for example tap install here then tap accept then wait for that theme to download and install on your android device then um, once you do that you won't you'll probably won't see anything that says tap open you won't probably see anything there that says open so you might just see something there that says install so from there if you just see an install button uninstall button uh, just get out of the play store go back into winterboard and then it should you should see the theme right there just tap the just tap the box next to that theme and make sure it's checked then at the top you'll see something there that says restart zygote or something like that I'm probably saying that wrong but uh, yeah you'll see something there that says restart zygote and it will restart your Android device and once it's fully restarted you should be able to see that theme on your Android device and uh, from there uh, that's it really now you're able to use that theme and that's it guys that's how to use theme chooser themes on the stock ROM of your Android device now if you guys like this video feel free to give it a thumbs up because that will definitely help me out and if you have any suggestions on what I should do next or if you have any problems with this um, app or this procedure whatsoever feel free to let me know in the comment section below and while you're at it feel free to subscribe to my youtube channel because i got tons more content coming your way i release new videos every saturday and sunday and thank you guys for watching i hope you guys will like me on facebook follow me on twitter follow me on instagram i left all those links in the video description below once again thank you guys for watching and i will see you guys in the next video this is demise 45 signing off